crackdowns from the state and local police, some East Texas cities are reporting fewer catalytic converter thefts for this year. And K-Tree's Marilla Gonzalez reports on why law enforcement says this trend is going down. Catalytic converters may look just like a big piece of metal to the average person, but for the last few years, well, the essential car part up, has gotten in the police. hands of thieves. It, uh, it's for financial gain, and um, you know, it's the pros are really good at it, and they can be under a car, out from under a car, uh, 45 seconds to a minute. Lufkin Police Detective Dalton Estes says, in his experience, thefts are likely to occur in public parking and home driveways. We have a tendency to think of this as a nighttime crime, but it, it happens right in the middle of the day as well. A new law went into effect this year, creating new criminal penalties for catalytic converter thefts, and Estes says he believes it has helped. Uh, the thing that's against the law is the unauthorized possession of it. So just us catching you in possession of that converter that does not belong to you carries that state jail felony penalty. According to State Farm Insurance, their collection data saw a significant drop in catalytic converter theft claims. And Texas was the second state in the country to see the big difference. In 2022, State Farm had 6,300 claims in Texas. And up until June, they filed 1,275 claims. Law enforcement is seeing the same decrease in Deep East Texas. Lufkin PD had 51 reported thefts last year, and this year they had 13. Nacogdoches PD reported 26 thefts in 2022 and up until this year, they have had only six reports. Uh, we started seeing a significant increase in the thefts for catalytic converters beginning 2019-2020. Nacogdoches Police Sergeant Britt Ayer says places that buy car parts are required to collect information on the seller and the vehicle the part came from. So there's a lot of accountability. So uh, for the thieves that want to steal the catalytic converters, there's not nearly as many places for them to take those converters and, and get money for them. Mariela Gonzalez, KTRE, East Texas News 9. Catalytic converter theft may be a state jail felony when the property is valued below $30,000, an offense that could land someone in jail for up to two years.